Good morning, YouTube friends and fans. Today, I got something interesting I haven't really seen anywhere else. Hopefully, it's helpful to you. And we're going to add lights into this line here. And we're not going to damage the factory harness, no splicing. So, stick around. KZ Creations thanks you for watching. Please press the red subscribe button for more featured videos in the future. Now on with the show. Alright, let's open this critter up. Hoping this shows up on camera, but basically, unplug the little light switch socket. And then, take you to the table here. So what we have here is socket and turn signal pigtail. We also have the bulb takeoff that's wired. So how the way this is going to work, we obviously unplugged that. So now we're going to put in a new socket and put in a pigtail here. So we're going to put this into the harness. We've got our other wires right here. Wall off. Tie all that together and we're ready to roll. No destruction to the factory harness. Alright, so we have the white wire as the ground wire, and that goes to the black cable here off of the socket pigtail. You got the green, which is got blue. All the way to the brown, so the B's go together. That is your low. And your red is your high. Red is your blinker. One off the red side of the wire. Now if you flip this around, it screws this all up. So it does make a difference. And just so I know I got it right, I'm going to paint mark this. We'll let that dry and we'll finish this up. All right, friends, I need your help. Go. That's with running lights. This is turn signal. The other turn signal. I lose the running lights when they're both plugged in. All right, we got it all figured out. So here we go. Here's the lock. So you got your blinkers. Here's the unlock. They stay lit. Let's check out the blinker. All good. Love it. Watch the end. I'll show you what I did wrong. So the light bars are going to get moved right here in this groove. And right now they're just tucked over top of the grill. So I'll drill a hole with a step bit. Put all that in there. Hide it nice and neat. Get the wires all prettied up. Got any questions, comments? Hope you like. Hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And uh, I'll show you what I went where I went wrong. Thanks for watching. So what we have here is the color coding is wrong. You notice it's black, white, red, and then black, red, white. So once I noticed that, my wiring problem went away. I thought maybe there was a voltage problem, but just a wiring problem on this harness I bought. Mm -hmm. 